again. Today I have another Stitch Fix unboxing. This is my uh, Stitch Fix for the month of November. I've decided I'm going to try to do these monthly. And if you haven't heard of Stitch Fix, it is a subscription service where you have a personal stylist select five items, fashion items for you. It could be clothing, accessories, shoes, uh, jewelry, and um, then they'll send it to you and you have um, three days once they send it to you to basically decide what you want to keep. So if you keep all of the items, you get a 25% discount. And the, um, if, you, if you keep nothing though, you're out a $20 styling fee, which is what you would be charged anyway. If you keep at least one item, the $20 styling fee will be applied to whatever you purchase. Okay, so, so actually I was off today and I went to Costco and I came back and um, came back, I had to unload everything. And this was waiting by my back door. So anyway, pretty exciting. And um, the box is a, a little beat up for some reason. And it's kind of like half, it's open a little bit. So let's hope everything got here safely. But anyway, let's go ahead and do the unboxing. OK, so there's the box. And I have the prepaid postage whatever bag and uh, this time I do have oh, and here's the information and um, I'll just kind of show you what I got oh gosh it looks like another another sweater so this is this is what I got this is the package so I got some clothing and it looks like I also got this time an except uh, jewelry and I did ask for uh, jewelry basically you can ask like before I had in my comments that I only wanted tops and dresses because that's pretty much what, what I'm into and what I felt I needed. But this last, for this last fix, I asked for um, a necklace. I wanted a, like a Y necklace. So we'll see what she got. So let's go ahead and open the letter. Let's see if I got my same stylus that I was getting. I usually get Holly. Yes, I got Holly again. Okay, so she says, Hi Tisha, I'm so happy to style you again, and I'm just delighted that you loved a few pieces from your last fix. Yes, I kept the um, turquoise, mm, what color? Uh, like turquoise colored jeans and also the burgundy colored dress, and I really like them, and I've actually worn both of those pieces multiple times. It says, I hope your trip to, oh yeah, I went to Vegas and LA, it was great. I just, I just got back, actually. And you're feeling refreshed. Um, it says, For this round, I started with a dress by Wisp, and I noticed Stitch Fix does have a lot of brands that I haven't heard of. I think they just try to work with up and coming brands. I think that's what I, my understanding. And I've also noticed that a lot of like, I think more than half of the items that I've kept from Stitch Fix over the past you know year or so, um, over half of them I've noticed were actually um, manufactured in the US. So I think that's a good thing. Um, okay, she said, the colors, <laughs> are beautiful, the purple really pops and will look great with black or nude heels. You asked for a cream colored duster, oh yes, I did ask for, I've been looking for a cream colored duster forever and I can't find one. So I included this longer length cardigan for you. Let me know if this is what you had in mind. I noticed on your Pinterest page that you have a lace sleeve top pin, so I nabbed a really similar style in black. So you really do need to make sure that whatever you pin to your Pinterest board you want because they, they do look at it. And I believe um, the way it works is there's some kind of algorithm and um, that interfaces with the Pinterest board. I'm not, I'm not really a computer person, but that's, that's my understanding. Um, it says, layer the Lariat style necklace by Barry Jewelry over the top with your teal skinnies from last time. I look forward to hearing back from you on how things fit. Enjoy, Holly. Okay, so, um, and then I do have the card with all the, I better not look at it. Okay, so let's go ahead and open everything up. So first, um, let's start with the, the jewelry. Okay, so everything's nicely wrapped. My dogs are, are down here and they're very interested in what I'm getting. Almost as interested as me because last time, <laughs> it's not a bark box. Oh, wow, this is nice. Let's see. Okay, so, um, this is a, a gold necklace. It's supposed to be a lariat style. So um, here it is in the box. And I'm gonna have to try this on. I'm not really sure how you put this on. 
So, um, yeah. <laughs> put this away. I, I really like jewelry. I really like necklaces. That's my thing. Okay, so let's see what I got. Whew. Okay, the first item. Hmm. It's by this brand, Daniel Wayne. Oh, it's nice. Check this out. Yeah, this is really pretty. It's a top, it's gray, it's kind of a light gray color, and it's in the size medium. And it has some really pretty kind of like embroidery, you know, that kind of thing with some pleats in the front. Yeah, it's very nice. So that's the first item. And then the second item, oh, what is it? Oh, this is the top shape. Yeah, I don't know. It's a black by Paper Moon. Oh, I like that brand, Paper Moon. I typically get a lot of things from there. And it is in a size medium, and it has these kind of lace sleeves. So we'll see. Mm -hmm. It's pretty. You can't really see because it's black, but I'll go try it on. OK, this one, I don't know. This next one, oh. okay, this is the one she said uh, by Wiss. Well, this is a dress. Mm. I don't know. I don't I really look like fitted dresses. This one looks pretty fitted. So we'll see. Mm. But it is very professional looking. Okay, and this is in a size 6 petite. And let's see. The last item. This is the duster that I asked for. It's not really... Mm, it's not really cream color, it's more like, it looks to me more beige. Because I really wanted something that was off-white. And I kind of already have a beige duster. And I'm not sure if I like these pads on, on the back of the elbows, but I'll try it on. And this is by a brand that I can't even read. <laughs> RD Style, oh, RD Style, it's not that hard. And it is in the size medium. So I got basically everything in a size medium. And um, yeah, but that, it actually says beige. So um, anyway, so <laughs> that's what I got in my six stitch fix uh, this month. But I'm going to go ahead and try everything on and see how it looks. OK? OK, so here <laughs> is the first item, or first top. Which I think might be the only top. Um, and yeah, I think it looks it looks cute. I like it. It's um, kind of delicate looking, and it has these detail on the sleeves. And I like the front. And it's by Daniel Rain, which is a brand that I actually like a lot. And I've got some other tops from him. But yeah, so this is the first item. And okay, so here is <laughs> the second item, and it's a long sleeve with lace sleeve top and it's kind of a nice weight and it feels pretty flowy and loose but it, it fits just right I mean, she's really nailed I, in the past the fit for me for the most part um, yeah but it's it's very nice actually I kind of like it I don't have anything like this I usually don't get stuff like with a lot of lace and yeah, but but it's cute and also I, I, I don't usually wear a lot of black um, I used to be into it, like I used to have a lot of black and white, but lately I've just been kind of not buying anything black. But yeah, so um, that's the second item. Okay, and now here's the dress. It's a little, it's a little snug. It's a six petite, and it, it's just a style. It's a very form-fitting style, which is not my usual, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, it's okay. It's 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 pretty. I don't know. It's just probably not anything that I would feel comfortable in because it's like, I mean, stretch stretchy. No, not that it's not comfortable. It's just that I think I feel self-conscious in this because it's it's too it's too snug, and I'd have to get like spanks, which I don't own. <laughs> so I just try to wear everything flowy, so I don't have to deal with that. But anyway, yeah. I mean, it's pretty. It looks like very sophisticated. Mm. <laughs> But yeah, I just don't know if it's me. Okay, so I have now the um, necklace. Oh, and just ignore this necklace. Um, it's one I was just was wearing. 
Um, so it's, it's very long. You can see that comes down here. It's pretty. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't have anything like it. And I think it's, it's kind of a nice piece. It might look really cute with tops and dresses, <laughs> which is what I have a lot of. So yeah, not bad. We'll have to see how much, how much it costs. I'm going to have to, I'll go over all the prices at the end. And I'm also wearing this sweater. And it's a nice, it's a very chunky sweater. And I mean, it's about the length that I was looking for. But the weight of it is a little too heavy for wearing in Hawaii, for me anyway. And I'm not really a big fan of these pads. And the color is actually beige. And I really wanted something that was more of a cream color. So yeah, it's really hard to find if you're looking for something specific. But anyway, um, yeah, so I think that's, that's all I had. So, <laughs> so we'll see, we'll see. We'll see how much everything costs. Okay, so um, now I guess let's go over all the prices. So the first item was the, uh, the necklace, which was by Berry Jewelry, and it was the Orinda Lariat necklace in gold, and that was $34. So I think $34 is, is a, I mean, it's not cheap, but you know, it's a, it's a decent price for this. It's a very nice piece. I actually really like it, and I think I want to keep it. So, okay, that was the first piece. Um, the second piece was the black top. It was by Paper Moon, and I really like that brand. And I've gotten um, a bunch of uh, Paper Moon tops before. I think I even have a dress. And that was the Burkett Lace Detail Knit Top, and it was in medium and $46. So $46 and that's, you know, again, not cheap. As a whole, Stitch Fix prices are not, it's not like Forever 21, you know, so it's, it's, it's not the cheapest, but I would say the quality is, is pretty good. So I like this. So that's the second item. I keep dropping things. The next item was the Daniel Rain that was a light gray top in medium, and it's the Carly Embroidery Detail Top. So this is a very pretty pretty top, and it's $64. $64. And I, I do like Daniel Ray, and I think it's a really good brand. And you see this brand, you see it a lot from Stitch Fix, and I mean, it, it's the kind of brand you, you can also get maybe at Nordstrom, I know. And sometimes if you're lucky, there's some rack. <laughs> but yeah, it's very pretty, and for $64, it's, this is not cheap but we'll see, I have to think about this. I actually, I just got back from a uh, trip to the mainland. I went to LA and Vegas and hit a number of outlet stores. So I did actually do some damage at the outlet, so. <laughs> I don't know if I should keep everything. Okay, next we got the cardigan. That was the RD Style Cassie Open Cardigan in beige and in the size medium. And this is $68. So $68, hmm. I mean, I guess it's worth it. It's a very heavy piece, and it's cute, but it's not really what I was looking for. I just, in my mind, I wanted to get a light, off-white, kind of dress length or duster length um, cardigan, and this is not it. I don't know why it's so hard. I've been looking for a long time. Anyway, okay, so that's the second piece, and $68. Okay, the last piece was the purple and black dress, and it's in a size six, six petite, so it is a petite, and it's by the brand Wisp. And yeah, did I say it's six, $68? Hmm. And this, I don't know, it kind of feels like a dragon lady dress, to be honest, and I'm not a dragon lady. <laughs> so here you go. I mean, I don't know. I, I, I'm sorry. I, I, it's a nice dress. And it feels substantial. I like the fabric and everything. I, I don't really care for the print at all. I mean, the colors are pretty, but yeah, it's just not my style. But anyway, <laughs> that was last, and it was, again, 60, $68. So yeah, I mean, as a whole, I thought there were some hits and misses in this Stitch Fix um, box for this month. Uh, I was happy. I think the piece I liked the best, to be honest, was probably the necklace. <laughs> So um, yeah, I will. We'll have, I'll have to think about it. Today's like, well, I just got it, so I have three days to decide. 
and I'm not really sure exactly what I'm going to keep or not. But um, when I do decide, I'll, I'll put it down in the comments what I actually kept. But anyway, uh, I guess that wraps up this Stitch Fix unboxing for November, and I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, if you did, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel for more unboxing videos um, going forward. So yeah, so <laughs> that's it. So thank you again, take care, and I'll see you next time. Bye now.